Hello YouTube and welcome to another Notepad++ tutorial. So today I'm going to show you how you can use the Android logger with Notepad++. So are you ready? Let's get started. Well, actually the Android logger is just a program that allows you to log all the messages that are running in your mobile phone. So first thing first, so in order to use the Android logger, you have first to install the ADB package. ADB stands for Android Debug Bridge. So you go to this site here and you download just, just that, this package here. You can also download Android SDK package and you will find it with the tools. So you install this package here actually it's a zip file so you compress it you decompress it whenever you want so here it is in my desktop okay so you open your command prompt and you go to the directory where you have your unzipped file so then you have to make USB connection with your PC so I will do that. Of course you have to accept USB debugging and to enable USB debugging in your phone. So I will accept, I will allow USB debugging in my phone. So in order to see if it was recognized by my PC, I will type ADB space devices. So you can see here that my device, my mobile phone is actually attached to my PC. Okay, so now you can use Notepad++ in order to install the Android debugger. So I will go to Notepad++. As always, I will go to Plugins, Plugin Manager, then Show Plugin Manager. And in the list of available plugins, I will search for Android Logger, as you can see here. So I will install it. So I have to restart my Notepad++. So I'll just hit yes. Okay, so now you will notice another sub menu called Android Logger as you can see here so here you can see the app log, radio log, Android shell, capture, filer, settings, about so in order to execute that I will just hit app log so here you can see all the log messages that are running live in my mobile phone So, for example, if I run an application in my phone, I get all log messages corresponding to it, okay? So it's pretty nice log Android logger that you can use in order to log the messages from your mobile phone. You can even make a capture of your uh, mobile phone. So if you go to plugins, Android logger, so there is here a menu called capture. So you can capture a screen of your mobile phone. And here it is. As you can see, this is my capture of my screen of my phone actually. And of course there is a setting menu. And this is the directory where you can find all your captures actually okay so that was just a brief introduction to this Android logger that you can use in order to debug the messages that comes out of your mobile phone as always I hope it has been informative for you and I want to thank you for viewing